really quick, uh, on the left side, I'll take it. Okay. on the left side, basic program, really lonely. That's all you get. Okay. Over here, looks better. So uh, I, I, I'm a kind of a stats guy, but I'm ashamed to say this. I asked my staff member, I go, okay, this is your beginner program. This is your level two program. This is also your level two program. Wait a second, what do you mean they're both your level two program? They're both my level two program, just this comes with more. You know where I got this from? The back of an antivirus software box. <laughs> this is actually in my enrollment binder, but I got the idea of it, of saying, why would I do virus basic? It doesn't protect my, e it doesn't do this, it doesn't do that. So if they were willing to do this, what are they willing if they can get that? So I asked them, right? My beginner program is $159 a month, twice a week. They go twice a week. That's this. This is the level two when they get to intermediate. It's 179, create your state ratio, whatever price proportion that is. This one's like $224. And I asked them, this is both level two. They will get you exactly to the same place. And I asked uh, Crew Chris, one of my uh, program directors, how many people did this versus this? And he goes, everybody has done this. I go, no, no, really. How many people did, how many people chose this and not this? And he goes, everybody, are you kidding me? They went from $159 to a 224 because they visually saw the difference by the value of what I gave them there. And I got to tell you, I give them the bare minimum here. You guys understand it? But I designed the bare minimum according to what their goals and desires were. Because realistically, we have very simple needs. We really do. I just want someone to hear what I'm saying. That's it. Why can't, I don't care about this. I just want somebody to let me finish a sentence. Sometimes that's all we want. So if I'm able to give them this, that's great. You know what this is supposed to be? This is like the ultimate upgrade that I would like every single person in here um, to have it within your school or community, right? Yeah, I'm so humbled when professors like, oh, this is the first time I did that. Listen, who wants to be the life coach of your community? Where your students, e everything that he said did not have to be said to a martial artist. That could have been to a guy who had a bagel shop. It could have been to a mom who was divorced. It could have been anything. You guys agree? So why can't you? Why can't you, the ultimate upgrade within your school is your student never ever had to throw a punch, kick, or choke. That they're literally there because of the experiences that you had. You're able to formulate it into a particular curriculum and regulate it in a certain way that they can get a result based upon what they asked for. I want to feel better. Well, you could only feel better by jump roping and punch. There's a lot of other ways to do it. Let's translate our physical nature into a verbal nature. Well, I can't really do that. Well, you guys are training right now through blogging. Maybe you never blogged before, but you're getting better at it. So what's the difference by blogging it and having a PowerPoint? And I'm literally just reading it. What's the difference? Okay. So if you're able to do that, you can kind of create that because if you're building up this, if you're going to be that guy in your community, you don't need 5,000 students in your school. You could have a workshop once a month in which you have all these people filling up your schools that are paying you a ridiculously premium price because you're hitting on points that really matter. Does everybody understand that? So if your initial um, way of bringing them in was, you know, certain amount of confidence or it was a certain kind of feeling or it was a certain kind of like fitness or whatever, okay, great. You could be a life, there are life coaches that just deal in fitness, truly. There are life coaches that simply deal with, you know, after and pick your, pick your area. It could be like post-divorce. It could be uh, uh, just depression. Or so. You, there's so many things that you can hit. And to understand that you could be like that charitable person in your area that deals with the things that are much greater than the punching and the kicking and let's really elevate whatever people think martial arts is, mixed martial arts is, fitness, because it's just that. Oh, they'll quit. They'll just do dance instead because it's more fun. Or are we actually going to create more value in the world and, and use the forum that we have, right? Whatever we say in our YouTube doesn't just have to be a technique. What we say in our YouTube can just be inspirational. Or talk about somebody else's inspirational story. Because they come into our school every single day. If you engage them, you'll... you'll You'll never not have a story to tell if you just have that. I always talk about having the reality show, right? Everybody could have a reality show in your own school because you know what goes on in there. It's too crazy. So through this, uh, uh, the existing classes that um, generate unique students, the students that we want are the students that we're going to get through our marketing, and those people will stay because they were, uh, there's addressable marketing in that. 
they were hit properly. We don't blast everybody, right? Oh, I have a million fans, but they don't really care what you have to say. They just want it, they want it to look like they had more fans. Let's be, let's be honest sometimes, right? So we don't want to have that artificial list. So to be recognized as a life coach or a success coach in your community and not just your students, guys, if I, if I could just impress one thing in there, get to that level somehow, however that's going to be able to take. <coughs> How can we help your school? And when I say help, well, Champions Way has a tremendous amount of value so that you can be able to build your reach so that whatever you have within you through your experience and your nature to be able to get out there in a form that will make sense through addressable marketing, through the people that will listen to what you have to say, and the people that are just like you. As far as crew is concerned, I think I can help a lot with curriculum as far as that. I'm not going to say you have to subscribe to what I do, but what I've done has been able to work with really small, like 500 square foot mom and pop part-time schools all the way to 20,000 square foot, uh, you know, unlimited budget fight teams that shall remain nameless, right? So it's been able to work with that because as I work with people, I'm a student. I take in all the things that they have so that you guys don't have to. So hopefully I could help you in that, in, in that way. So uh, the, the thing, I broke a rule. Everyone starts with, who am I? I end with, well, who am I? I'm you. I'm a lifetime martial artist. I train for... Next year will be 30 years that I've been training. My parents never, ever, ever remember paying for tuition, ever. My first day, I was a little kid. I'm Filipino descent. My mom made noodles. We call it pancit. I took the pancit. I stole it. I went to my local martial arts school, and I offered it as tuition because I was really into kung fu movies. And I thought that's what you needed. It wasn't money. It was dedication, and it was loyalty. Maybe I was weird because maybe I was the only guy who did that, and everybody else's parents made them go. But I went there because I wanted desperately to get something out of it. And all I needed was one thing, and it got me hooked, and I'm still here. So if, I can, if you can get somebody else hooked, and you know, uh, Sensei Nick uh, or John Malik said, make sure that they're local to you. Well, you don't have, they might be your local student, but you really can get students, you can get students worldwide, right? Through Champions Way, you can have a virtual school. There's a lot of people that are willing to, to be able to do everything that you want to do. So we're going to cut that really quick. All right, guys, uh, I'm going to leave that up for the very end. If, it, if anybody's interested, um, you, very easy to find me. There's not a lot of, uh, by the way, Ace is my real name. There's not a lot of Ace Ramirez is out there. So if you Google me, you'll be able to find me. And uh, I'm waiting for the hook. <laughs> all right, guys, if you have any questions, I'll be here all week. All right, brother. All right, brother.